a note on the approach when uh, when studying or trying to follow a relatively complex derivation uh, there is a there is a trick on how to um, how to not really memorize it but how to understand the flow of logic and spot inconsistencies um, and this is to start at the beginning and form a special case so, so for example the the whole theory is supposed to work for one specific example and then as the explanations uh, become more and more uh, complicated you you still follow that simple example and if the logic breaks down there might be uh, an error in the actual derivation uh, there was a famous um, physicist uh, Nobel laureate Richard Feynman uh, and um, you it's a, his fascinating character so there is a autobiographical book surely you're joking mr Feynman if you haven't read it I highly recommend it this is this is great and he he was uh, somebody commented as how uh, how he was able to spot uh, errors in derivations even in the areas that were only remotely related to his area of expertise he would be kind of sitting in the lecture and they said well there might be a mistake uh, between this and this line and then when people go back check their calculations and sure enough there would be a mistake there and then they asked how he was able to do this and this is the approach he suggested so he basically he said that i would uh take a special case something that i can actually hold in my mind and then i i try to move it along through the uh, the derivation and then when when it doesn't work for that special case anymore um, I ask a question is it uh, is it a bad example now or is it an error in the in the derivation so just just as a study tool I think is a is a, a good technique to use